Welcome back my beautiful divas to another vlog If you are new to the channel, welcome to my channel. My name is Dania aka Diva D. If you're not new to the channel, today due to popular demand, we are back. My favorite makeup artist, hey Nadi! Hey. <laughs> She's back and we're gonna do a makeup look for you guys. You guys loved the first video and it did so well. Thank you guys for yeah. watching. But anyways, we're gonna do a makeup look now and we can't wait for you guys to see it. So yep. stay tuned! Bam, we are doing the foundation. The beautiful Hanadi is almost done putting the foundation on. Uh, first, uh, I corrected the area that needed correction with the Makeup Forever, um, the orange mm -hmm. corrector. Yeah. Then I applied uh, uh, a still loader foundation because you want the foundation to still longer today mm -hmm. so I did put for you a full coverage foundation I think I used three W2 okay um, it's a bit yellow on you but I'm gonna lighten it and yeah with the with the concealer and stuff okay perfect yeah so I'm gonna spray fix plus all over mm -hmm. and then two seconds and I'm gonna blend it Okay. With a um, wet sponge. Okay. okay. Tapping, 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 tapping. By the way, you know the tips you gave us last on the last video? Yeah. Where you said about the eye contouring? Yeah. I always do it now and I love Thank it. Thank you. Thanks for the tip. If you guys are new and you haven't seen the video I did with Hanadi, it's super awesome. I'm going to leave the link in the description below so you guys can check it out. So make sure you check out the other video with Hanadi because it's super awesome. If they loved it, and it was so good. Thank you. It cheers me up so much. I know. Thank They're you. so sweet. They're so sweet. We love you, divas. We love you guys Thank so you much. Thank you for being so kind. Yes. Sometimes we need it, you know. We need some love. Everyone needs some love. Yeah. And makeup, of course. Now I'm going to contour. Okay. For contour, I'm going to use 177. Mm -hmm. I don't know what's the um, new numbers for... Uh, for makeup forever because I think they changed their numbers. Okay. But I'm gonna use the contour. See where is your hairline? Yes. From here. It starts from here. Mm -hmm. I pulled it. Yani, this is your cheekbone. Yes. Sah? Yes. I went above it. Not gotcha. in, on the cheekbones, above the cheekbones. Okay, cool. And the other line was in the end of your la uh, your eyebrows. Eyebrow. Yeah. And here, so this one is a bit confusing. It's oh, is it always under here or on? Depends. For for you, Matheran, it's supposed yeah. to be under because you have a small face. So I want to make it, yani, a little bit wider. Yeah. Um, if you want your face to look long, mm -hmm. you only do put it here. Best if you have a um uh if you have like face. a big face. Yeah. I advise you to 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 put the line above. Okay. To make you. it smaller make okay. the area smaller so if you want to make your face a little bit bigger you do it under like how you did it for me mm -hmm. and if you want to make it smaller like if you have a bigger face and you want to have a smaller look you can put it on top here yes cool for the nose i'm gonna lift it a little bit mm -hmm. real life it's totally different than, than on camera because on camera it's like this yeah <laughs> like in your face yeah yeah thank you no worries anyway so yeah this is the right contour i didn't pull it up why because you already have a small area here so if i lift it until your uh, eyebrows it will look like it will look like your eyes are cross-eyed yeah okay got you and I like this mm -hmm. lip thingy. To make the lips a bit bigger. Yeah. And I always tell people, if you want to make your uh, lips look bigger, you have to always focus on the center. Don't make it bigger. On the bigger. corners. Yeah. 
because this will look fake. Okay. And I like this. What does this do? It makes your face like, you know, Pop? When you ha yeah, yeah. And if you have the, the your ch because your chin is small, so mm -hmm. I'm, I'm 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 making more definition to it. Okay. So now, Hanadi, can you explain to the viewers what we're doing? Okay. So what did I do? Mm -hmm. Everything uh, I need to teach people something about contouring and highlighting. What does it mean? Mm -hmm. Contouring is. Inf يعني, making everything that I want to define or to hide darker. Okay. And making everything that I want to attention in it. Okay. And to brighten or مثلا to um, make it يعني, more visible to the eyes mm -hmm. uh, is highlighting. Okay, so got you. this is what I need to teach people about because sometimes people think that highlighting is contouring. No, it's not contouring. Okay. Contouring. So what did I do? Mm -hmm. I wanted to build definition to the cheekbones, to the to to this area to make it like lifted. Mm -hmm. I did put a darker shade, which is a contouring color, mm -hmm. and I wanted to make this area. Uh, show because you know when you want to know that this person looks healthy mm -hmm. you can see his cheeks or you can see this area brightened so this is what I did I highlighted this area mm -hmm. and I wanted your cheeks uh, your um, your cheekbone to look like more um, wider and um, to give you a, a, a yani a square shape face okay more yani and yeah. your face is small okay. so i highlighted in this area so elongating the yes, face exactly okay got you so i used two faced uh, as a concealer uh, mm -hmm. i used warm beige and i used for highlighting um, makeup forever uh, shade number 31 okay i love it and uh, for contouring as i mentioned before i used uh, 177 it's a foundation shade, but I like to contour with it. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna use a creamy blush from Makeup Forever 510. Okay. This is the 510. Okay. I'm gonna put it here. And don't panic, I'm gonna blend everything together mm -hmm. and it will not look like. So exactly on top of where you contour. Yes, and I can put it here because يعني, if I want to show that you have cheeks i'm gonna put it here okay but if i want to hide your cheeks or maybe you want to lift your cheeks mm -hmm. I, i'll put the blush here okay mm -hmm. on this area interesting okay awesome so we're gonna finish this and we'll be back in a bit boom hanadi you're killing the game mm -hmm. you're killing the game <laughs> like this, is this is, are you a plastic surgeon because my nose looks really <laughs> smaller after this I swear it looks so tiny what do you guys think I love it I'll tell you what I did okay. uh, I set everything with a loose powder mm -hmm. and then uh, I did I focused on making the nose also more smaller so mm -hmm. I highlighted the, these areas and I kept the contour got so, you you can only you can blend it with your hands hatta but then i'll blend it more I don't know. you have to try just to highlight these area because you're trying to define your contour and your highlight mm. so this is the trick got you yeah nice so which for, uh, loose powder did you use i used Carioline. i like it and okay. i prefer uh, laura Mercier or Carioline. i like okay. them both okay awesome i'm gonna use mercury i'm gonna use this palette the new Huda Beauty palette. I just got it for this tutorial. Oh, by the way. I just so got exciting! It for you guys. So we discussed behind the camera, and Hanali is going to surprise you guys. But it's going to be a great surprise because when she told me what she's going to do, I'm like, I've never done that before, and I can't wait. <laughs> and you know, Hanali is awesome, so it's going to be beautiful. Ah, so, so I'm excited. super excited. So for the crease, I'm going to use uh, the color Libra. Mm hmm. Okay, 
So now I'm gonna go with Hot Mess. I like this shade. doesn't know how to draw a eyeliner so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna take a black shade you're using Charlotte Tilbury I love Charlotte the Tilbury. new Christmas collection it's, sorry for it's such a nice I'm pla amazed by this palette and I also used it for uh, both of my last looks mm. uh, on my last models I, I it's amazing I it's have it amazing. and I love I'm it impressed. and my favorite one of my favorite makeup brands is definitely yeah. Charlotte Tilbury Yeah, I loved it. I love they it. get it right all the time. Yeah, so I'm gonna take an angled brush mm -hmm. I'm gonna tap it in the black color Okay for whoever doesn't know how to draw an eyeliner look straight You oh the, the right eyeliner for for yourself is in the end of the lash the last lash mm -hmm. connecting your last lash with this i don't know what they call it um in the end of your lid okay yani there is a line here so i'm gonna draw your eyelid yeah yeah and i'm gonna put a dot here so this is the right line for mm -hmm. you for your eyeliner can you close now i'm gonna connect it close or look down look down adi connect it open mm -hmm. see so what i'm gonna do now can you close yep okay you guys so Hanadi was drawing the liner and then my, my hand was in the way so we're gonna draw the liner she's gonna do it and then she's gonna explain how to do it so okay. we'll be back as soon as we finish it so just ignore the line I don't want you to because it's kind of difficult but mm -hmm. what did I do connecting yani, an angled brush mm -hmm. a small one if you have because um, I don't know where is my small one Okay. so a small one you just Put the line and the end of your the last lash you have. Mm -hmm. Putting a line connecting it to the end of your lid. Mm -hmm. The end of your lid. Mm -hmm. When you're open, opening your eyes. Okay, so you see the line, you guys. You can yeah. see the line. I connected it with a line, and you can do it with the the powder, black powder eyeshadow. Oh, okay. It's better for you. So if it doesn't doesn't work, you can erase it later on. So I connected it and. I did a line here, mm -hmm. a small one. Gotcha. Then I went in the end of the lash, uh, end of the lid, mm -hmm. and I draw draw it, and then you can, yeah, you color it. Just ignore these, mm -hmm. and I color it. Yeah. Got you. That's the first step. Yeah. So we are going to finish this beautiful eye look we're going to add the liner and the mascara Glitter and highlight and stuff and and we're going to surprise you guys so this is the overall look you guys got it and we explained it and then we're gonna do the other touches and we'll see you guys in a bit boom the eyes are done and oh my god henadi <laughs> by the way this is the first time i see it with you guys because oh, the shadow it's the first time i see it with you guys because i i didn't want to see it i want to be surprised like you guys were and i love it wow look at that it makes my eyes look like pop it makes my eyes look bigger yeah and so i wanted gorgeous. something dramatic something different yeah and i know you told me that you've never done this so I wanted to yeah, something different for it. sure. Yeah. It's gorgeous. So should we tell everyone? Like, can you tell us just a quick summary of what we used? And yeah, of course. Awesome. Uh, so for the whole look, I used um, Huda Beauty, mm -hmm. Mercury. Mm -hmm. Anyway, so I used at the beginning. Uh, I used Libra. Okay. And after this, I tapped Phantom. 
okay. I did apply it all over the lid. Mm -hmm. Then I came with a darker shade, okay. um, like a black one, just to overline, as to sketch what I'm gonna do. So I sketched it, mm -hmm. and then after this, uh, that was the part you're explaining to everyone yes, how to do the liner. Yes, you sketch and that. After this, uh, I drew the eyeliner. I used for eyeliner, I used Anastasia, mm -hmm. uh, the the new one. Okay. And under the eyes, yeah. I used super, super, supernova, supernova, supernova for yeah. under the eyes. Yeah. It's gorgeous. Wow, it's so pretty. I love it. So what are we gonna do now? Now, as always, uh, I'm gonna use uh, Benefit uh, Brow Setter mm -hmm. just to fix the brows. Fix the brows. I don't. I'm. I'm not gonna use any pencil or something because I don't think you need it. Thank you. Microblading. Shout out microblading. And if you guys want to see the video of when I did my eyebrows, my microblading. Make sure you check it out. It's I've done the video and I'll leave it in the description below as well so you guys can check it out. Everyone is asking about called Deep 50 from Sephora. It's my favorite, favorite, favorite. This and is the I'm, one they were asking yes, about in the last yes, video. Yes, it's yes. Deep 50 from Sephora, guys. Yes, exactly. Because I didn't even know. <laughs> so they're asking like, I don't know. But okay, so Deep 50. Okay, so for now, I'm gonna use... Makeup Forever, um, brush number 158. Okay. I'm gonna tap it on the places that I want to bronze. Same places you can't to it, right? Yes, exactly. Okay. I'm gonna go here. As I told you before, I'm trying to lift mm -hmm. the eyeballs. And here, just just to give a color. Beautiful. Boom, the look is complete and I am loving this look. Thank you, beautiful Hanadi. Thank you. She's beautiful and she makes her clients beautiful. I love it. Mm -hmm. So what you guys missed is, Hanadi, what did we use for the highlighter? Uh, Ofra. Mm -hmm. I used, um, I don't know what they call it, but it's Nikki Tutorials Collab. Okay. It's this shade. Thank for you. blush, I used Copper Tone from MAC. I like this color, mm -hmm. it's matte. And I also applied Fenty uh, Diamond Bomb. Sorry for how it looks like, because mm -hmm. I use it that much often. <laughs> uh, how many carrots? Mm -hmm. Only here. This is why you're Gorgeous. glowing. Love it. And uh, at the end, I sprayed the new Mist and Fix from uh, Makeup Forever. It's a new formula. They said it has more oxygen into it. For the lips, I used a combination of also uh, from Makeup Forever. I used these two. Mm -hmm. uh, Makeup Forever 109 and I used um, 501 Artist Roach. Awesome. So this is the complete look. Hope you guys enjoyed it. It's different. It's gorgeous. It's Hanadi style and I love it. Thank you so much, Hanadi. And a lot of you guys have been asking for Hanadi's YouTube channel. Yeah. Tell them why. It's under construction. It's under construction. But it's coming soon. Yeah. Promise. And as soon as it's ready, you guys are going to be the first to know. So it's going yes. to be in the description below in this and video. I'm excited. So stay tuned for that. And it's going to be awesome. And leave in the comments if you guys like this look, what kind of looks you want me, us to do next yes, time. Yes, I would love to know what they want to learn yeah. and also i would love to know what type of looks do you look forward to try to make me try on dania yeah i would love to do yeah that. i would love to hear from you guys so leave in the comments below hope you guys enjoyed the vlog make sure you like subscribe share with a friend follow hanadi on instagram and all her social media is going to be in the <laughs> description below follow me on instagram and on tiktok and i will see you in the next vlog i love you i love you i love you